When playing on most CDJs in clubs, there's only one decimal point after the BPM. So for instance, this is probably 124.0. This is also 124.0. But when you look on your controllers, you've got two decimal points. And what that means is that the controllers are probably a little bit more accurate, but then when trying to line up the BPMs on controllers, it's also pretty tough. So let's say I'm on here, for instance, and this is actually got 124.0. But if there's two decimal points, this could actually be 124.09 and this could be 124.01. And that means you've got them the same, but you kind of tweak it. Now, yeah, sure, you can hit sync, but I'll be honest, some of the older gear doesn't have sync either. And if the, when using sync, if the grid isn't exactly on the beat, can still kind of sound a little dodgy too. So I don't really like using sync. I, I like doing this, but a lot of people, when they make the jump from controller to club, they're not used to it coming out of time. I don't think it's that big a deal if they drift and you're just doing little micro adjustments as you're playing. I think it's all part of the organic feel of 